that on the first night, since it's quite, it's going to be like a launch night, so try and get the people in is to get an ice skating rink. An ice rink? Yeah, an ice yes. rink. Yes. Portable yes. one, yeah. Got it here. There's a quote on there on this account. Um, so can I just ask you quickly, how much would it cost to put an ice rink in here? Eight hundred pounds. Is that all? That's all plus the AT. <laughs> That's what Jeremy's doing. <laughs> <It's> a bank <laughs> holiday. <Okay. laughs> it's not the phone part. <laughs> Does the eight hundred pounds include then bring the company you obviously going to bring in? Do they bring in all the shoes as well? They bring the shoes. There's transport here. And how back. many shoes will they bring in? I'm not sure about that. I haven't gone that far into detail. <sighs> Don't you but think it was enough? Should. Okay, but with, um, I mean, I love the idea. I think it's fantastic, actually. I do love the idea of an ice rink in a, in a nightclub. So are we talking that this is just an ice rink nightclub or is there anything else? No, here? no, that would be the first night as a launch night. And then um, there's other ideas which I'll put on to the proposal. So on, on, just, on the first, sorry, on the first night and you've got the ice rink, is that the only thing going no, on, on like, that night? It'd be like snow machines, so it'd be like a... It'd be more like a sewing machine. Snow machine. Like a winter wonderland. Yeah, like a winter wonderland. Yeah, like a winter wonderland. Okay. Okay. Yeah, but what, what I'm thinking in my head at the moment is, right, see, so someone like me, I, I wouldn't get on an ice rink. No, there'd be two other rooms as well. I'd have okay. that, uh, all the events on the main floor and then there'd be other two rooms to choose from. I can't remember the names of the rooms though. Would, would you have the whole... And no, the whole club open. only only the main floor and two other rooms. Which, Which other rooms? rooms? Uh, R and B. So you pop. just rip off what I'm doing already. <gasps> but it works. See, I love the ice rink. I think that's original. But if you're going to put R and B back into the star bar, you're just copying me. So can you just tell me a bit about? Because I'm just reading this. What's the 3D disco? It, it goes with um, <laughs> it goes with the music. So everyone that comes in will get 3D pair of glasses, Dell style, like blue and red ones. And it's their choice, they're one of them or not. And then they, there's a company that comes in, they put a screen up and it'll go with the music. Okay. There is, I had, do have see, video now, on see, my phone. See, so immediately, my first impression is right. Do the ice rink on the main floor and do the 3D disco upstairs and you've got something original. Yeah. Okay. Okay. That's what I'm actually saying. That's immediately what I'm thinking. Because I'm thinking R&B room, what's new about this? Yeah. I mean, I'm seeing something here that is original and then you lost it. Okay. By having an original. And what's your CO2 UV party as well? It's the canisters that blows up CO2. So okay. Those like UV lights as well. It. Oh, they also we, throw the UV paint over people as well. Or have you yeah. not? I didn't know oh, that. No, did you know that, 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 that now? <laughs> yeah. No, I've been off at that. That's something we were going to do, but I just thought gays. Um, I didn't know you could do that. What are your timings? What time will this, this event? Because I'm actually not looking at it as a club event now. I'm looking at it as more almost like a kind of a fun fair, really fun, yeah. different Sunday early evening out. Um, no, I'd, say, I'd still say from about 10 to about 4, I'd say. And okay. what's your market age range? Anyone. Anyone. Anyone, okay. because you're only as old Just as gay? Feel, really. No, One no, of the no, things no. that concerns me about you. I'm being honest. Yeah, no, be honest. Yeah. It's a, you know, there are certain questions I'm throwing at you and you don't know the answer okay. and you should have come prepared with them. Um, you, because you, you've half done the job here. You've given me uh, £800 for the ice ring. You've given me, I, I haven't got the price for 3D disco, but I'm going to ask you now, how much are you going to charge to get in? I'd say £2 for 12 and £5 on. Okay, but how do you know that? Why do you, because... The problem, the problem is, how do you guessing. know how much to charge? Because you don't know how many people you can get on the main floor, how many, yeah. therefore, because that affects what capacity you're going to do. And you need to make sure that the door charge covers the cost of the ice rink, the 3D disco and yeah. all of that. And you can't do that unless you've worked out your numbers. Because it may be that if you can only get 100 people on the ice rink at one time, that actually £2 isn't going to cover it, but £3 may. Okay, cool. Okay, thank you very okay, much. Is this your first time in heaven when you haven't been really drunk? Yes. <laughs> yeah. What's it like? It's different. No music, no people. Yeah, I think you're in alright. Um, so, how do you think the judges responded to your ideas? Good. Yeah. I've, well, a few things I missed out, but yeah, I think they went well.